My name is Karen, and I can't stop eating. morning it is a monday the 22nd of november i'm in my mum's car because mine is in the garage it's been recalled plus it's needing some things doing to it yes already um i'm outside the doctor so i'm going in for the results of my x-rays on my legs and my feet so let's see what palaver they come up with now um i haven't had anything to eat yet which is unlike me these days because i'm eating everything I'll tell you what i am either so good you cannot put a crumb past my calories in my mouth or i'm horrendous and i eat my calories yours and yours and yours and yours and yours yeah i'm terrible I seem to be gaining weight rather than losing it at the minute. Don't know whether it's the time of year, whether it's the stress in my life or what. But I've got a day off today. As of, well, Mondays are now my day off. Um, yeah, so I'm waiting to hear when I'm going to get my car back. And what else today? Mum's birthday on Wednesday. She's going to be 79, old floss. So she wants a cake to take to her little meeting she goes to with her friends. I did offer to make her one, but she's like, oh, don't go to that effort. So I'm just going to go to Aldi's and get her one. Um, what else? I should really be going Christmas shopping because Santa's sack is quite empty at the minute. I'm going to end up doing it all in one go, I think. But yeah, Santa's sack went to Costco to get a new TV and Dexter was pointing out all these toys he wanted so I was like oh, great um hmm now I have got to keep an eye on the time now because my appointment's in a minute but I downloaded to your surprise Slimming World app no I'm not doing Slimming World calm down I paid for the app I got it till the end of January just to put my mind at rest that I still didn't like the plan and it's worked expensive experiment but yes Weight Watchers app is on my phone I think that finishes at midnight tonight but I'm not doing Weight Watchers so that's fine um, and I got the Slimming World app but I had a curry pouch curry pouch sachet of curry powder um, last night now, it was really good on calories. I didn't use it. It was just in my cupboard. Um, I didn't use it. But, because I had the app, and I had the Weight Watcher app, I thought I'd do a comparison. Now, the Weight Watcher app, it was something like three, three, three points, I think it was. The Slimming World app, it was eight and a half cents a portion. And I was like... But calorie wise it was mega low and I just I know there's obviously science behind it or whatever it is but nah you can keep your eight and a half sins so that's clarified that one thing I should have done when I had the Weight Watcher app um or I could actually I think I've got use of it today I could maybe try if I've got enough time I haven't eaten yet it's done a day's worth of food and seeing the difference between the Weight Watchers, the Slimming World and the calories. But, yeah. Out of all the plans, my preferred plan is Weight Watchers. But overall, it's calories. It's just sticking to the bloody things. Why can't stuff be calorie free? Why can't all the crap I like to eat be really good and then all the healthy stuff be really bad and then I'd, I'd be skinny in no time so I'm going into the doctors now 
do I say? Oh, you know that gastric sleeve I backed out of? Can I be referred again? Because my double chin's now becoming a bit of a triple, you know? Jesus Christ. I do think to myself, Warren begged me not to do it, see, but I think, oh, shall I, shall I inquire about that again? Hmm. I've seen so many people on TikTok going over to Turkey, having it done. It's like, oh, shall I, shall I do it? And they're like losing 10 stone in like five months. And it's like, Jesus Christ. Anyway, I've run out of time. I'm going in the doctors. I'll catch up with you in a minute. Well, I'm now out of the doctors. That was pretty crap. I hate doctors. <sighs> she said, yeah, as soon as um, I seen you, I could see your leg wasn't straight. Mm. It's like, no shit, Sherlock. She's, I don't know what they're talking about, these doctors. She said, yeah, you need to go for x-rays um, so we can send them off to blah, 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 blah. I went, Oh, you mean the x-rays I had the other week? Oh, you've had them with you? Yes. Anyway, she was reading them out. It said I had severe... I said, can I have a copy? She said, oh, you've got, um, you've got to ask at reception. I didn't bother asking. I wanted to get out of there. I have got severe degenerative something or other bollocks about the knee. And she did agree with me. Now she thinks that my leg's never been set right when I broke it that time. Hence why it's the shape it is. Anyway, she was like, yeah, you need to lose some more weight. And I was like, nice stick thin doctor. Yes, I know I do. Yes, I'm trying. Very fucking trying. I know I need to lose weight. And then she said, oh, do you want to go on... Um, such and such a program no I don't thank you um not program as in TV <laughs> exercise program so I said to her do I look like someone that exercises I said um I said oh thanks for your offer but I won't take you up on that one because I said I ain't no person to get down on a yoga mat never get back up and she was like, um, are you sure? Well, I can put you on this program, put you on that program. I think they can give you free, oh, bloody phone, free, um, Slimming World, don't they, for 12 weeks. I was like, okay, you can keep that and all, thanks. Um, yeah, so keep trying to lose weight. Yes, I am, thanks. Even though I've been putting it on lately. Bloody hell. So I'm being referred now to some specialist, somebody or other, who will then refer me on to someone else. I'll tell you what, I'll be dead before my leg's done. It makes me think, oh, let me just put up with it and suffer. Can't be asked. So then I said to her, Oh, is it a waste of time going for this appointment? They're just going to turn around and say, oh, you're too fat. And she was like, well, they may say that. Yeah, no, you have to be quite small now to have your knees done. <laughs> I should have never gone now. It just pissed me off even more. Makes you want to go and get a bar of chocolate. But I'm not. I'm not. I've got to get back on my calories without going over them it's 11 o'clock nearly i've not had anything to eat yet <sighs> but i got a prescription for something else so i'm gonna go into tesco now and get that flipping it life tell us prescriptions for transamic acid another woman's issue flipping it Talk about being depressed. I'm not one for being depressed, but Jesus Christ. If only I could chop that leg off and have it. Even though my knee's dodgy, I tell you what needs to be done to my leg, and I'm no doctor. It needs to be smashed. 
or however they do it, they need to break the bone in my leg and reset it straight and put my knee straight. I'll be right then. Flipping neck. Right. We're going to Tesco now and I'm not going to buy any crap because I'm on a diet. Do you know? I'm on a diet. <sighs> Why is it going to be calories in food, for God's sake? Why can't it be calorie-free? Point-free, sin-free. Right as you go in the door, it's right by the Krispy Kreme counter as well. We'll bang three of them down now, no problem. <laughs> oh, right, I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm going to... I've got nice bread in the house and I've got brie and I've got cranberry and I've got spinach. I'm going to make a nice sandwich for lunch. And for dinner tonight, what am I going to have? I think I might do that chicken curry. I think I might do, yeah, chicken curry. My jacket spud. <sighs> a bit of salad. Sounds random, curry and salad, but it's quite nice. Right, enough talking crap, enough depressing myself. And it's even more depressing. I've got to go back again at half past four with Jackson. Jackson's got a Veruca. We're not <clears throat> we're not ones to have Verucas, really. <clears throat> I mean I've never had a Veruca. Kids have never had a Veruca, but Jackson's got something on his foot, which I think is a Veruca, and he was limping this morning. So back at half past four for that Duh. and then got to try and pick my car up as well because my mother's car's all right like but jesus christ it's slow here's another 10 people in it when you're going up the hill oh can you tell i'm just fed up Right, into Tesco's, home for lunch, bit of cleaning, pick the schools up, back to the doctor, pick the car up, make dinner, go to bed, and then get up for work. Bye guys. Well, I am now back in the car. The sun is blazing. Remind me not to go to Tesco's anytime soon. It was absolutely manic. I usually do scan and shop. Didn't bother today, just did my own. Queuing halfway up the aisle, should swear it was Christmas week. Anyway, just picked up this. 158 calories for the whole tub. And I'm gonna munch that on my way home. So I'm now home. I have made a sandwich which is brie, cranberry and spinach. I'll put a breakdown on the screen and I'm also having a bag of this popcorn for 61 calories. So that is what I'm having for my lunch. Well, I am now at the school. Where's this day gone? Where's it gone indeed? So, got my car back. It's going back again on Monday. The reason the sensors weren't working is because they've been turned off. <laughs> Somehow, someone turned them off. But it wouldn't have been me, obviously. Obviously. Anywho, that's not the only problem. It's gone back on Monday. They said, oh yeah, your horn isn't quite right, is it? No, it's not. It's drunk. So it's gone back in for the horn. Um, and Warren's car's having finally getting his second key programmed to the car. Car, it's a hassle, aren't they? Nothing but hassle. Old lady nearly got one over. So, one will come in from work and they'll be like, you haven't done anything. 
have. Oh, God. Mackenzie's making scones in school this week. So I've had to get him the ingredients for that. Do you know what? The lady just pulled up next to me and went. So I'm hard to the table. My leg. And she's not disabled, right? But she's always parked in the table. But there's no spaces left, so she hasn't. So she's parked in a space that isn't a space. And blocking all the other cars in. That's me being a cow. Is Dex still the same? Oh, you're such a cow. Right. Got nothing else to say, really. Been a bit of a boring day, but busy. The sandwich I had was really nice. Really nice. Littles seeded bloomer bread. Their bakery's not on the actual bakery, but it's called like bakery on the packaging. Very nice. And also weigh it because mine turned out to be less calories than it said on packaging. And now I'm getting weird looks from the woman in the car next to me on the other side because I'm talking to myself. So yeah. I'll catch you later. Dex is doing his guinea pigs when we get home. Gonna go home, drop Dexter back and Mackenzie. My mother's coming up to watch Dexter because I can't leave him in the house. So I'll take Jackson to have his foot looked at and then we're gonna clean out the guinea pigs. Exciting stuff. So this is my tea, jack of potato with curry and I've got a samosa and an onion bhaji. I've worked it out through the recipe on NutriCheck. I will stick it on screen what it is. I'm absolutely knackered. So nothing very exciting. Just that. So I've got quite a few calories left still. So I will show you what I'm going to use them on after, if I use them.